So my name is Anthony Stewart. I go to Santa Monica College. Uh, I was at the party for literally 30 minutes. <laughs> so I got there like 1.30 maybe. Um, as soon as the cops, we actually went to both parties. So like everybody can tell you, it was two parties, one across, both across the street from each other. I went to the predominantly white party first. Then went to the black party, because we knew people at both sides. Um, when they came, the cops came inside, they shut down both parties. They said there was a noise complaint. That's fine, everybody started leaving. Then while we were leaving, the mic was on the DJ making shout outs. The cops came back and they called for help. Why they called for help, I'm not really sure. Long story short, then that's when the more police officers starts coming. They arrested Nate, the person that's throwing the party. Then one by one, everybody starts taking out their phones. We're telling people Instagram, Twitter, Instagram, Twitter, make sure you record this. We, didn't, we weren't doing anything wrong. There's no reason for them to just start detaining people. Then they started detaining some of the people that were taking photos. So, one of my friends, one of his friends had just got arrested. I was holding him back. I was holding him. He was just yelling and screaming. Then they pulled us apart. They said they arrested me from holding, for holding him. So, that's what I was detained for. So I was supposed to be arrested with everybody else. They ended up letting me go an hour and a half later. I sat there in the cop car the whole entire time, listened to the whole conversation on the radio, them laughing about stepping on the girl, them laughing about blocking everybody off. Okay, oh, they're not leaving? Let's just start arresting them. I heard the whole conversation, and finally at the end, they let me go. So personally, I feel like it was just unnecessary force. 79 officers, yeah, we counted, because we were there for that long. So 79 officers for a party that already had security guards. I do parties all across California and in Vegas. It's supposed to be two security, I mean, one security guard per 50 people. We had two people at the door checking IDs and everything. The white party across the street had nobody. When the cops came to disperse the party, they told us to leave. They told them to stay in the house and wait till everything was over with. So it was just like, it was just it was unfair. We were already leaving. They blocked us off from going to our cars and stuff because we all parked right in front of the party. They, made us walk all the way down to damn near Hoover and Adams, parties on 23rd. So I just feel like it was just unnecessary force. And when I mean force, like how they did the handcuffs, I still have the imprint on my arm from them sitting there so long. I have a scratch on my neck from when he had his knee on my head. He had his knee on this side because I have the scars on this side from the concrete. Then I also have all the, on, the, on my arm from them stepping on me. So it's just like, it was just unnecessary force. They didn't have to do all that. Especially because there was no guns, no violence, no drugs. We didn't throw anything. We didn't fight back. We didn't do anything except take pictures, take videos. So that's how I feel about it.